Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So here we'll be trying to solve this homework, which is to simplify the following expressions. So simplifying really means just collecting the like terms. So if you've got z's, you combine the z's. If you've got x with x, y's or y's. So let's, let's just try and go through all, all of these uh, eight problems. So for the first one, oh yeah, my recommendation also is to pause this video and have a go at these questions first, if you haven't already done so. Otherwise, press play and let's, let's get the show on the road. So what do we have? 3z plus 2y minus z. The first thing you want to do is do 3z take away z because they're like terms. So z just means 1z. So 3 take away 1 is 2, so that's 2z. And because you only have a single 2y's, and then you just copy it because there's no other like terms. That's it. Now, for part B, we have 5a minus 3a plus 6a. Easy. So because of all a's, we can just add or take away and do the math. So 5 take away 3 is 2. And 2 plus, eight is, uh, 2 plus 6 is 8, which is 8a. Yeah. C, we've got 4w plus 2v minus 2v plus 2w. So we have, so let's look at the w's first. So we have 4w and 2w. This will give us a 6w. And then we have 2v minus 4v. This will give us a negative 2v because it's small, because 2v is smaller than 4v. Good. Now for part D, what do we have? We've got 5c take away 3d take away 2d. Well, looking at the c's first, there's only 5c, so then we just copy as it is. Then we've got minus 3d minus 2d will give us a minus 5d. Combine the d's. Okay, e, looks like we're dealing with more than two like terms now. So here what do we have? We've got 3, a normal number, plus t, plus 2u, minus 3t, plus m. Oof. So these kind of problems you want to take your time. So I'm going to highlight the numbers firstly. So we've got 3 and 7 is what we combine. We're also going to combine, I'll pick the light blue, t and, th and minus 3t, remember. And that's it. Now all you want to do is just combine. And oh yeah, 2u is by itself. So for, to make it easy, I'm going to start with 2u because it's done. It doesn't matter how you do it as long as you get all these figures. Then I'm going to combine the t. So I have t minus 3t would make... Um, minus 2t because because t just means plus 1t and lastly we've got 3 plus 7 and 3 plus 7 is just 10 and that's it easy so the same thing applies for f we've got f take away 7 f minus 7 plus 3f yeah, minus 2g plus 8 so let's start with the f's so we've got f plus 3f will give us 4f next we've got uh, G so we've got just so we just got minus 2g only so minus 2g and lastly we've got minus 7 plus 8 so 8 plus 8 take all you can do 8 take away 7 which is plus 1 all right final two problems so we've got 3s plus 2r minus 7 plus 3r minus 7 s plus 4 Whew. okay that's a mouthful so let's just break it easy so now let's start with s's so let's start with r's actually we've got 2r plus 3r which is 5r and then S terms, we've got 3S minus 7S, which is obviously minus 4S. And lastly, the numbers, we've got minus 7 plus 4, which is minus 3. Good. Finally, H. So to wrap this up, we've got 3 take away 2H, take away 3J plus H minus 4. Again, starting with, let's say, duh, duh, duh. let's start with the numbers this time. So we've got 3 take away 4 is minus 1. Minus and then solve the h's. Mi minus 2h plus h is minus h. And then we're just left with minus 3j because that's what it is. And that's it. We well, guess we're done. So if this video helped, please give me a like. And um, if you want to watch the next part, which I recommend, check out the next sections for simplified expressions. This is only the first part of homework, but there is more to be seen. Other than that, I shall see you guys soon. Ciao.